What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we've come to Wales to check out this little abandoned house we've found on the side of the road. Place looks absolutely amazing. Little frozen in time cottage, exactly what we like. So we're gonna get straight in there and check it out. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit notification for future explores. Check out this absolutely amazing view behind me. And yeah, we'll get straight in there guys. Hope you enjoy it. Okay guys, we are inside the house now. It's such low ceilings. Look at this. Wow, it seems to be kept quite well as well. Straight into the living room here. Check this fireplace out. The old gas fireplaces. A few ornaments and pictures around. On a quad bike there, it looks like farms. The family pet. Wow. Yeah, my trophies here. Darts League, it looks like. Oh, I'm just hitting the, uh, the light here because it's so low down. But check this as well. Got the old military pictures, whoever this is here. Maybe an old picture of the owner. More trophies. 1969 there. 1965, wow. The old trinket cupboard, seen better days. Looks like somebody's been in and helped themselves to that. All the crystal glasses and whatever. Nice carvings on it though. Wow. What a shame though, that this place has been left. The old tea trolleys in between the chairs here. It's got two little kiddies playing on a bike. This is a shame. Old ye oldie England there. Look at the wallpaper as well, very retro. I think I think about this house is that just an old vase. Yeah, it's not an urn or anything that. But these are very 70s, aren't they as well? The settees. Look at these. The old fire poker. The old set there. Oh, there's a few crystal glasses and stuff like that in there. Inside this old suitcase. even got the old electric heaters. How busy is this main road now I'm filming? <laughs> we just get a pan of this room, check this out guys. Nice little cottage this. See the decay, the wallpaper's starting to peel away. I do believe it's been abandoned since 2004, I'm led to believe. Look at these. This the door frames here. Not built for the larger gentleman like myself. Right, which way shall we go first? Yeah, we'll go up this way. There for hanging your uh, tea towels on, but they look like little buttholes. Oh, you're saying I have to, uh, wow. I have to duck down through all these doors. 
what we got here more glasses and plates and such quite nice patterns on there as well really nice don't want to touch it because it looks like it's about to fall down that definitely seen better days as that a lot more decayed in this part but I do have a feeling this is an extension oh look at this old record player old vinyls look at this BBC 3 Luxembourg is there a, a make on it or something Cambridge Pi Cambridge who was they listening to RCA Victor Moonlight and Roses if anyone has an idea of a date or anything for Moonlight and Roses let me know in the comments oh, back when we could have page 3 here it's got a year 2002 I think that is just make that out newspaper of the year the Daily Mirror well, well we know that's not true anymore so a bit of age on that this seems to have been left alone check this out all the plates and little ornaments hidden away in the kitchen here check these out a little boot there porcelain it feels like oh creepy that's a little Welsh lady there check this all quite good condition as well can me arties or something I'm not sure more trophies check this out there I've got some vibes in here guys so I might uh not sure what that was might give it a little necrophonic before we leave a little butt scratcher butt scratcher might be worth a little go on there into the bathroom oh, check this out still got the washing lay on the floor there got the razor on the side of the bath still oh my days that is grimy as this is definitely an extension guys look at this just like a flimsy DIY window there all covered in cobwebs and the old school heaters see them a lot on the farms no electric we got water no no water either we have got washing though which is strange so something definitely happened in a hurry for them to leave their washing what are we down here uh, cooking utensils hang on hello Since I rang that bell, a bit weird now. Oh, check this out. This is definitely an add on. Like a batch porch. There's your garden all overgrown. Ooh. Socks still hung up drying. Oh, check this out. The old singer. Still on its unit. Oh, that's rusted it's not moving that we've got old buttons and watches here a whole jar of buttons there as well oh, wow. cash book oh that wasn't this address it's all right what a strange little place this is just on the side of the road 
push forward to the next room. Kitchen. All bits on the side here, kettle. Wow. That's got an address that I'll have to try and buy her that if I can. All the irons. Whoa. Heavy. We're under the stairs here. Creepy little spot. Take up cups. Tiny this kitchen though. Oh, anyone can move about in here. Check that out, what's that? Is that like an old coffee maker? Instant coffee maker or something, I don't know. Absolutely no room at all to move here. All cups and saucers. Diabetes recipe. All recipes. Oh god, what are they? Almonds. 27 and a half pence. Oh, that tells you a bit of an idea. It's half pennies. Yeah, we've got some food down here. <clears throat> some creamed macaroni. 2003 that went off. Well, it went off in 2003. They have long shelf life, don't they? 2001. So it doesn't look like anyone's been here for a long time. Got family photos. Little babies. Oh, look, Christmas. Oh, that's sweet. Right, what else do we have? Got another room here as well. Ooh. Bit of a dining room feel in here. With the table. There's only one chair though. 19... 1956 Bible. Uh, diary, sorry. We have cutlery on the side, little teapots. We do have a TV in here as well. The old Hayachi tube back. 1992 diary. Wow. Look at that Luxor alarm clock. If anyone has an idea on that. We've got a jacket hanging up, old farmer's jacket. Tweed is that. There's a chimney, there's soot all coming down here. Ooh. Look at these guys though. It's an old World War II picture. All the military there. Looks like they're sat in a cafe, having a smoke and that. And we've got these two women here. Not really sure who they are. She looks like the one from the other room. And, uh Tatley guy. It's a cup of tea fella. Wow, look at this. You can see the different ages through the years as well. On the wallpaper. That's definitely 70s or 60s, and then that would be 30s or 40s maybe. You can see it going through the years there, that's, that's cool. I like that. Guys, what a place this is so far. Gonna have a quick look upstairs, see what we can see. There's quite a few outbuildings I wanna check out. And I uh, just wanna have a quick glow on the Necrophonic. Just because a bit of a weird feeling in here. But uh, look how small everything is. This is crazy. Look at these stairs. They're so narrow. I can barely get up. Oh. Yeah, they don't feel the safest either. Check this out though. Look how small these rooms are. We'll start on this side. 
and work our way through. Wow, oh, this guy's just shit me up. I don't know what he's doing. We can see bits thrown all over the floor here. So the wardrobes are empty. There's a few bits in here, I've got a few books and what have you. Old vases, jugs. Look at these books here, the bushwhackers. Shadow on the trail. Cowboy books. A few golf balls and what have you as well. Definitely getting a feeling of an older couple living here. Look at this, structural damage as well. Walls all cracking. Oh, floor doesn't feel the safest in there, I'm not gonna lie. Wallpapers all peeling. Oh, what do we have here? Little ornaments, trinkets. Nice. There's not too much to talk about up here. It is quite bare, derelict. Bits of furniture, a few bits of clothes. Not too much up here, to be honest. What's this though? This looks interesting. Look at that jug. It's got a gold chain hanging off it. A little bow peep there, chilling. Gas fire. Mm. Old Domino set showing kit. Deirdre Barlow's. Oh, look at these cobwebs. Absolutely disgusting. What a place, though. There is some amazing stuff in here. Definitely worth checking out and doing a little video on. Obviously, it's not the biggest place. It is a creepy vibe in here, though. So I am just going to uh, do a quick necrophonic. Just see if we can get anything. And then we'll head outside. Ooh, freaky. Alright, guys. I have the necrophonic set up. I've come into the back room where the TV is. Just most vibes in here and we've got the old pictures of the army fellas and the two women in here so i thought this would be a good room to check out right so we've got the necrophonic let's give it a little go is there any spirits in this house that want to communicate three one did you say there was three spirits here Is one of the women in the photograph still here? Are you both here? That's freaky. Can you say anything clearly into the device for me? Were you one of the soldiers in the picture? Well, it sounded like that. Were you one of the soldiers in this picture? Are you still in this house with me now? Come. So if there's any spirits, is there anyone in the living room with me? Is there anyone in the, this room with me? There's some quite clear voices coming through. Did you pass away in the house? No? Yes. Was it one of the females that passed away in the house? Or was it one of the gentlemen in the picture? Guitar. 
Get out. Did you say get out then? <laughs> Would you like me to leave? Would you like me to leave? Just did footsteps from down there. Is that you in the hallway? It's hard with this traffic as well, guys, not gonna lie. How many spirits are in this house with me right now? Sounded like two, is that right? I quite it. I quite it. I can't even talk now. It's freaked me out a little bit. Is that you crying? I've never heard that voice on here before. Was that you crying into the device then? Do it again. Can you do it again for me? You make her cry? That was freaky. I'm not gonna lie guys, that freaked me out a little bit. That, I've never heard that on the device before. That was such a weird... It was a cry, wasn't it, more than anything? Right, I feel like there's definitely someone here. Maybe they're just not ready to talk properly yet. Maybe nobody's been here to get some energy going or anything, I don't know. But I just want to have a little look outside. Just because that's freaked me out basically more than anything. We've had a nice look around, there's plenty left inside here with the vases, old pictures, some nice war pictures as well. Definitely worth coming to have a look at. And we'll just have a little look outside now and see what's knocking around out there. Let's go. Right guys, there is a couple of outbuildings to check out, but I don't think there's going to be much in them to be honest. And we are right on the main road here, with cars flying past. And as you can see it's all quite overgrown and that there's not much in there, just a chair. And look, cars are flying past constantly. I don't really like being out in the open where people can see. But we will just have a quick look inside these buildings just for a car or something more than anything. Ooh. Just old hay bales there. And on that side too. Someone's kicked this door down. There is fresh tracks there. So it looks like a farm is actually using these fields. Don't know if you guys have ever heard of uh, the angry Welsh farmers, quite notorious. I don't think they're really keen on herbexing. I don't think they know what it is, to be honest. No, just more hay in there. There isn't much in these outbuildings, but it's just worth a quick look just to see if we can see anything. There's a nice little house, guys. I think I'm going to leave it here. So we've got some more to get to and explore today. Nice little house that was. Nice trinkets inside. Surprising how much was actually left with it being on the side of a road like this. But yeah, I quite enjoyed that. If, that did freak me out, that necrophonic. Usually you'll hear the same kind of voice coming through. And it'll just be interpreted in different ways, whatever. I've never heard like a little girl crying before. So, didn't quite fancy sticking around after that. But yeah, absolutely amazing place. I've really enjoyed it. I hope you have as well. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit notifications for future explores. I'm off to the next one, as I said. And I'll see you next week, guys. Cheers.